video is on how to count the number of atoms in uh, a sample. So the question is, how many atoms of oxygen are there in 28.4 grams of sodium phosphate? The first thing that you need to do is write the correct formula of sodium phosphate. The sodium ion is Na+. The phosphate ion is PO4 3 minus. We need a ratio of three sodium ions to every phosphate ion in the compound, so the compound is Na3PO4. Okay, now I want to convert 28.4 grams of that and count how many atoms of oxygen there are in that many grams. So, in order for me to do that, I need to know how many uh, uh, moles, uh, uh, the molar mass of sodium phosphate, how many grams of sodium phosphate are there in one mole. And to do that, I need the periodic table. And I need the molar mass of sodium, phosphorus, and oxygen. So I go to my periodic table, and I see that sodium has a molar mass of 22.99, phosphorus 30.97, and oxygen 16.00. So, we have three sodiums at 22.99 grams per mole. And that's 68.97. I have one phosphorus at 30.97 grams per mole, which is 30.97. And then I have four O's at 16 grams per mole each, sixty-four. And then I'm going to add those up. And I get 163.94 grams per mole. Okay. What that means is one mole of Na3PO4 equals 163.94 grams of Na3PO4, and that equals 6.02 times 10 to the 23rd units, we say units because it's ionic, it's molecules if it's molecular, Na3PO4. Okay. Um, or, you know, some people, your teacher might use molecules for that. It's really not a big deal. Okay. So I'm starting with 28.4 grams of sodium phosphate. So I start with what I'm giving 28.4 grams of sodium phosphate. And I know that there are 6.02 times 10 to the 23rd units or molecules. For every 163.94, grams of that substance. So that first step just counts up the total number of formula units of Na3PO4. Um, all it's doing is counting up how many molecules or formula units of Na3PO4 there are. Um, but that's not what the question is. The question is how many atoms of oxygen are there. 
And so each unit of, of Na3PO4 has four atoms of oxygen. So if I, if I have one Na3PO4, I have four oxygen atoms. If I have two Na3PO4, I have eight oxygen atoms. Or if I have one mole of Na3PO4, I have four moles of oxygen atoms. And so I'm going to go ahead and write, I have four atoms of O, of oxygen for every one unit of Na3PO4. And you'll see factor label, grams cancel, units cancel. I didn't write that in for space. And what do I type on the calculator? I type 28.4 times 6.02 and then use your scientific method, E23 or 10 to the 23, depending on your calculator, divided by 163.94 times 4. And my answer is 4.17 times 10 to the 23rd atoms of O.